Hey guys and welcome to another video tutorial yet again. This tutorial is going to be about uh, your hint, your hint screens that pop up uh, letting the player or individual know what's going to happen, uh, intel briefings, whatever you want to put in that hint screen to let the player know something is about to happen or what they, just important information basically. There's going to be, I'm going to go over two different types. Uh, one's just a little fancier than the other. The other one's just a basic black box, and one is good for like objectives and such like that. So to start off, all you want to do is go ahead and place a character down. Doesn't matter what. Then go ahead and place a trigger. Obviously, activation is going to be set for a blue four. Unless you want to synchronize it, that's up to you. Now, I'm going to make these triggers a little bit differently. Basically, if you were to make a mission, you would just set the trigger size to whatever you would like. I, because this is a tutorial, I'm going to just set them to radio triggers so I could just give you a demonstration for each. Now, for the fancier hint screen, um, let me type this out real quick. Okay, hopefully everything works out like I typed it. It took me a minute. Um, so basically what I did right there where it says Intel, that you can type in whatever you would like. That's going to be the title for your fancy little hint box. You can put briefing or info or Intel or warning, however you would like to put it. This is going to come, depending on how you type it, it's going to look fancy. So this is mostly used for objectives like a, an objective screen. So if I were to type objectives, instead of it being like I wrote everything in quotations like that, it's just going to put a little bullet and then it's going to say that in a big black box. If you were to do objectives, you would just make sure to type a uh, comma and then quotation marks again. And then again. And then that's all you would do, and it would make separate bullets for each individual uh, quotation marks that you have placed. So the top one is going to be just whatever you would like it to say as far as your intel information. And then the second is going to be another set of info, I guess, for different objectives. So two different ways for one hint. Hopefully that works. Like I said, I might have to mess with that again. And then I'm just going to make another trigger. Same same thing, only it's going to be just a basic. There's not going to be that fancy. And that's it. Just hint. That's all you really need to put. And then in quotation marks, what you would like to say. 
Oh, and this is going to be set for Radio Bravo. Now let's go ahead and preview this. Like I said, let's hope these work. We will go ahead and do the basic hint screen first because uh, I know that will work and then we will go ahead and move to the fancy hint screen. There you go. There is your basic hint screen in the top right of the corner. That's what it would look like. Now you can make it to where they come over a trigger for blue four and that's what is activated as soon as they cross it. You can set them for individual players that you have synchronized to it or op for or blue for. Now for the fancy one, there's the fancy hint screen. Like I said, if you were to just do Intel with the paragraph information, you could do that just fine. And there is the example for the top uh, the top bullet. And then it's mostly used for objectives like I was stating. So objective one and objective two is the other example for the fancy hint screen. And there is where you would put your title, uh, your title name, whatever you would like to put, briefing, intel, objectives, etc. And then once you're ready, it, it freezes the whole game so you don't have to worry about anything happening to you while you're reading. And then whenever you're ready, you just hit continue. And then as you notice in the top right corner, it also displays uh, like a little sidebar of information in the top right so you don't have to. Um, worry about like oh wait what did I I forgot what I read well that's up in the top right you don't have to worry about it well guys I hope you like this uh, brief tutorial on hint screens um, please comment like subscribe and I will get back to you guys as soon as I can and if you'd like to see more videos please help me out and like and sub subscribe so I know that people enjoy it I enjoy it if you enjoy it thanks guys for watching